saying prove and true over and over again. And that is that here in Illinois and in communities all across this great state, the wisdom is in the room if we will only just listen. Problem solving is not just done by a few people in the governor's mansion or even the General Assembly. Problem solving is all of us working together to better our state. It is the chorus of women rising up against the misogynists in the White House and speaking out against the sexual harassment and gender discrimination and pay inequities that have made us suffer for far too long. It is the inspiring and courageous students demanding that elected officials enact common sense gun laws to stop slaughter in our schools and streets that has gone on far too long. And it's residents of forgotten communities all across our state, which have su suffered decades of disinvestment, who are claiming their seat at the table and making it abundantly clear that we no longer want policy to be done to us, we want it to be made with us and for us. in the prosperity their labors create. We have the wisdom. We have the passion. We have the power. And we're going to use them to defeat Bruce Rauner and we this government. For three long years, we've seen the profound damage Bruce Rauner has inflicted upon our communities. For three long years, children, seniors, persons with disabilities, veterans, families, and individuals in every corner of our state have paid a severe price because Bruce Rauner has failed us. Tonight is the beginning of the end of Bruce Rauner's failed government. We are building a campaign that is bigger and better and more inclusive than any the state has ever seen. This is a movement that rejects Bruce Rauner's poisoned politics of division, disinvestment, and destruction. It is a movement to take back this state. And leading this movement is our next governor, J.B. Prince. when we lack a caring and competent chief executive. And then I met JB. I saw his strength, his passion for bringing people together, his generosity, and his ability to get big things done. But more than that, more than that, I saw his compassion. And I saw someone who was deeply affected by the many people who were hurting because of Bruce Rauner's failure, and someone who decided he could not sit on the sidelines, risking another four years of Rauner's division, disinvestment, and destruction. J.P., I am grateful for your leadership, for stepping up for Illinoisans in every corner of this state, and for asking me to be your partner. to create a future Illinois with abundant opportunities for all. JB and I are ready for the fight. And it's a fight that we readily take on. 
because we know our cause is just and it's the right thing to do for the people of this state that we love so much. And ladies and gentlemen, we know that you are under no illusions and neither are we. This will not be easy. Bruce Rauner is a desperate man. And in his desperation, he's going to do everything he can to distract from his unprecedented record of failure. And it's going to be a fight like we've never seen. And to win it, JB and I will need every single one of you. I know we're ready. I know we have what it takes. And together, we're going to take down Bruce Rauner.